So now we're on the LibreOffice store, and who are you? Hi, I'm Gabriele Ponzo, and I'm in the membership of the, the Document Foundation, the foundation who cares about the development of coordinating the development of uh, LibreOffice. What, are the, what do you have in your store? What are these leaflets? Well, these materials are for marketing, and we have English ones and Chinese, Taiwanese uh, ones as well. And those are intended to present what is LibreOffice and also how to migrate from common uh, commercial suits, office suits to, to LibreOffice. And so you're promoting ODF as the lovely standardized format for office suites. How is that going? Has it been adopted in many countries and companies? Yes, especially in 2014, uh, there is the UK government that they have chosen ODF as the official uh, standard as a format. And that means uh, a lot because it opens uh, a lot of doors, let's say this way. And because many other governments are uh, following them with, uh, with such a decision, and so they are moving to ODF as well. Obviously, they couldn't say we, uh, let's say, LibreOffice is our official suit because this is not politically correct, but they can obviously decide on the format and the, the rest is, you know, something that will come. And, um, and where can we find out more information to take part in using or converting to Open Document? Oh, well, uh, it's a good, good question. I mean, um, the first thing is to understand the importance of the freedom and the independency, independence sorry, of uh, the format, and knowing that there is um, uh, the OSIS, which is uh, who cares about the ODF standard. And that means that this is not uh, the LibreOffice format as well as or open office or whatever. It's a, a, really an open format, and so this, this is really something that is not uh, owned by anyone. Uh, I, I, this is the opposite of, for example, Microsoft Office, who uh, they do the software and also the format. So this is the first important uh, things to, to be understood. Starting from that point, you can say uh, you can say you can show, for example, the uh, the real openness of the format, meaning that you can uh, just unzip the file, whatever file and show the content, which is just plain text XML. And that means that, let's say, within um, one century or the next centuries, you may be still able to uh, open and read the documents, even if, let's say, LibreOffice or whatever software is not able to do that, because it's just a plain text XML. And that means also that I'm, what I used to do when I, when I do trainings is to show the, the, the text file, the XML file, and show that a human can read it without any software installed. So, thank you very much, and thank you for coming to KDE Academy. Thank you. Thank you to host us, and uh, it's really a good event. Thank you. Have a nice day.